What kind of wedding would you like? I... I don't know. Well, I do. I've been planning my wedding ever since I was a child. Hey, honey. Are you listening to me? What's wrong? Nothing. You seem kind of preoccupied. I'm not. No. I love you. I love you. Thanks to God, her results were good. I was worried I was on my way to the hospital, but Dr. Salim said not to. The treatment? They're starting tomorrow. It'll be very tiring and intense. Here's hoping. What does that mean? Of course she'll get better. Salim will get better. I didn't say she wouldn't. I think we should have a party for her. We'll celebrate Celine finally accepting the treatment. Sounds good. We need to be positive for her. Celine needs to feel strong and happy right now. Ah, Celine? Hello, guys. Welcome. Where did you go after leaving the hospital? You'll never guess. I went to Kareem's place, and I accepted his proposal. Anna? Darling? Hey, Mom. Kareem, son, I missed you so much. When did you come home? About half an hour ago. Why now? It's pretty late. I missed you so much, so I decided to come. I just thought you'd get angry if I asked you first. Where's Anna now? Was Anna here too? Yes, for a bit. Something came up, and I, I had to go out. Oh, really? There was no one here when I came. The door wasn't locked either, so I thought that maybe... Kareem. What's wrong? Is she not answering? Maybe she didn't hear it. Don't worry about it. I don't know. It's just not like her. She'd never leave without telling me. I wonder if she went home. Of course. Where else would she go? Look, you fancied him and you two hung out. You can hang out with whomever you like. I can't say anything to that. You can even go home and live with the guy. But now you're marrying him? Besides, why don't I know that he proposed to you? It's not like I give you reports on my private life on a daily basis, Ken. This is not just anything. This is a proposal. Like you care about my life. I don't even see your face anymore. We discussed this. That's your fault. You wanted it to be like this. You wrote me off, remember? That's enough. Ken? Celine, stop Mom, this. Mom, won't you say anything? Why are you keeping quiet? I want you to be happy more than anything, dear, and you know that. But isn't it too soon for marriage? Mom, I don't have time for ifs and buts. 
I don't even know how much time I have left to live. And here you are telling me it's too soon? It is soon! Because I'm in a hurry, don't you get it? I'm going to marry Kareem whether you two decide to support it or not. I'll be honest with you. I don't trust that guy at all. He has a name, Kareem. Whatever. Try to think about it, Celine. You belong to two different worlds and you are ill. And he proposes to you right after you meet him? Here you are defending him. You can't see it? Everything is clear. Celine. You proud of yourself? Well, somebody had to be honest with her.